Today we're going to use the search capability within the Atlas platform to explore drugs. In Atlas, on the left-hand side, you'll see the first feature that says search. If we click there, we're brought to a search screen. Let's say we were interested in identifying drugs that belong to the class called ACE inhibitors. Well, we could search for the phrase ACE inhibitor and hit search. And when the search returns, we see all concepts across the OMOP standardized vocabularies that contain the phrase ACE inhibitor. On the screen, we see a table that provides a line listing that lists the concept IDs, concept codes, and names, as well as information associated with the domain and vocabulary. On the left-hand side, we see facets that allow for you to filter this information down to areas that may be of interest. And on the top right-hand corner, you additionally have the ability to search using a string. So if I'm interested in drugs that belong to the drug class, I may choose to filter this to the drug domain. I may be interested in seeing that there are multiple vocabularies that classify drugs in the ACE inhibitor class, and I can make a choice of which of these classes to explore. For example, I may be interested in the ATC class called ACE inhibitors plane. I will select this particular concept. When selecting this concept, I'm brought to a details screen that tells me about the concept I've selected. I can see that I've selected ACE inhibitors plane. It belongs to the drug domain. It is a third level concept uh, within the ATC vocabulary. The ATC code for this particular concept is C09A, and this is a valid concept representing a classification concept. In the OMOP standardized vocabularies, classification concepts are terms that we expect to be able to use to aggregate standard concepts for purposes of analysis. From this particular details page, I can also explore the related concepts or a hierarchy view to now identify what concepts are related to ACE inhibitors. When I click on the Related Concepts tab, we get a similar view whereby I'm seeing line records here, uh, and I have the facets on the left-hand side to be able to filter down. If I'm particularly interested in identifying the drug ingredients that are standard within the vocabulary that belong to this class, I can use the filters to filter down to standard concepts, which have a class of ingredient. Here we can now see that large list of potential concepts has been filtered down to 15 entries, and we can now see the individual drugs belonging to the ACE inhibitor class, starting here with lisinopril and working our way down, here sorted based on the number of records observed in the database. If I go back to search, another way that I could identify a class of drugs would be to start with one member of the class. So if I was interested in lisinopril, I can search for the term lisinopril to identify what class this individual ingredient belongs to. When the search returns for lisinopril, we can observe that there are many different concepts that contain the string lisinopril. I may be interested in a drug concept that is a standard concept. And we can see this first record here from the RxNorm vocabulary is lisinopril ingredient that we can make use of. So I will select that particular concept. When I select the concept of lisinopril, I'm brought to a screen that allows me to see the details and to explore the related concepts and the hierarchy. Here I will go to the related concepts and use the ancestors to identify what classes this particular concept belongs to. We looked at earlier the ATC classification system. So if I filter my vocabulary to ATC, we can again get back to where we were before, that lisinopril as an ingredient belongs to the class ACE inhibitors, 
with that ATC code of C09A. By using the OMOP standardized vocabularies, we can explore these relationships to find groups of drugs that belong to a class, as well as to identify classes of drugs and identify all of the member ingredients. This concludes our video of how to explore drug vocabularies using the search tool in Atlas. If you're interested in learning more about additional features within the Atlas platform or more about the Odyssey community, please check us out at odyssey.org.